scanning facial features and matching to identifiable records. Stand by. Identity confirmed. You are the Jedi Knight who defeated Darth Angro and saved multiple Republic worlds. Opening Hollow Channel to Republic Fleet Admiral Jedi Master Oteg. Stand by. Channel open. Hello. My name is Oteg. I serve the Jedi Order and lead the Republic's first expeditionary fleet. I need your help. I didn't know you could be a fleet admiral and Jedi Master at the same time. I've had many titles in my lifetime. I prefer being called Oteg. <laughs> it's shorter. I've received intelligence that the Empire has a secret prison inside the Maelstrom Nebula. It's a dangerous region, impossible to safely navigate. A Jedi prisoner possessing vital information is held captive there. I need your help to navigate the Maelstrom Nebula and free him. You can tell me all the details in person. Give me your coordinates and I'll meet you there. I'm aboard the First Expeditionary Fleet's command ship, the Dreadnought Telos. Transmitting coordinates now, and please keep them to yourself. Oh, take out. Welcome, my friend. I appreciate you coming all this way. Oh, do forgive me for not shaking hands. My hospitality exceeds my reach. <laughs> Before we begin, I'll ask that you keep an open mind to what you're about to hear. The source of my information is, um, unconventional. A Jedi is prepared to accept help from any source. Such wisdom in one so young. Well, Master Satil's faith is well placed. As a Jedi, you are already attuned to the Force. But you must deepen your connection to see as I do. Concentrate with me. Focus your mind. Feel the Force around us. Hear its echoes. Yes, the Force is with us. She is here, a Jedi without physical form. Her body is long dead, but her wisdom, her essence, lives on. My master died, but his voice still speaks to me. One Jedi persisting beyond death is almost unheard of, but two? Oh, these are strange, dark times indeed. The darkness will consume all it touches. Stars will burn black. Ashes raining on lifeless worlds. Everything ends. The prisoner holds the darkness at bay. Lost inside it for three hundred years. His strength will fail. Then, he will become the darkness. The prisoner has been fighting the Empire for centuries? How is he still alive? The bond weakens, my friend. I'll take things from here. She's told me many things. Revealed the existence of an Imperial prison in the constantly shifting Maelstrom Nebula, and a way to get there. The only way to navigate the Maelstrom is using a Gree computer hidden at an Imperial fortress. We need that computer to free the Jedi prisoner. I'm a Jedi. This is what we're here for. The fortress we're invading is on the planet Taral V. Enemy territory, protected by Imperial warships. Too many to fight. But we have a captured Imperial shuttle that can sneak past the sentries. It's waiting for you in the hangar. You can fill me in on the rest while we travel. There's no time to waste. Our fleet will hide at the system's edge, so I can monitor your mission and guide you. If something goes wrong, we'll come running. Now go to the shuttle, my friend, and may the Force be with you.
outstanding. You've given us access to the Empire's communications. Are you there, my friend? I read you. Go ahead. Our data slices are quietly shutting down the Empire's security grid. The enemy's in for an unpleasant surprise. The time for subtlety is almost over. Make your way carefully to the fortress, but once you arrive, strike quickly and hard. How fast will those ships in orbit respond once they hear what's happening at the fortress? The sentry ships aren't prepared for a ground invasion. They shouldn't be a factor. I'm sending coordinates to the fortress. The Grey computer is amazingly compact. You'll have no trouble carrying it out. I'll keep quiet from here on, unless it's an emergency. Or we'll take out. You, on my doorstep. Fortune has always favored me. You've been busy since our last meeting. Saved Coruscant, Tython. A pity about Euphrates, but uh, you can't win them all. Sadly, your victories end here. My fleet is about to bombard your position from orbit. This place is designed to withstand a lot of firepower. The fortress shields have been deactivated. You're standing in a tomb. And I'm burying you in it. It's been a pleasure catching up, but you won't escape this time. monitored that transmission. My fleet is moving to intercept the bombardment. I'll do my best to keep the Grand Moff busy, but you need to hurry. Find that green computer and get out of there. Huh? Republic butchers, you've invaded a sovereign imperial world, slaughtered dozens of innocents to what? Steal our research? This facility is on a mission of peace. We're charting the Maelstrom Nebula for the good of all. You have warships in orbit and battalions on the surface. If this is your version of a peace mission, you're doing it wrong. We knew once you discovered our research you'd attempt to steal it, and here you are. When the rest of the galaxy hears of this unprovoked assault, the Republic's evil will finally be exposed. It will surprise no one when the Jedi are revealed as warmongers. All you've ever sought is my culture's extermination. Your empire started this war. Before that, it was the Sith who tried to enslave the Jedi. We take no pleasure in killing, but we do what we must to protect the Republic. Spare me your platitudes. I see you for what you are. A murderer. You're condemning hundreds of civilian science vessels exploring the Maelstrom Nebula. Electromagnetic radiation alters the safe navigation routes every moment. Without precise and timely coordinates from the Gree computer, thousands of good people, innocent scientists, will be trapped there forever. The Republic doesn't leave civilians to die. Transmit fresh coordinates to your science vessels and order them home. Then, the computer's ours. But our research! All that dangerous exploration will have been for nothing without a complete map! Transmitting the coordinates now. The computer is yours. I hope it breaks the first time you use it. It's taking heavy losses and the fortress defenses are crumbling. There's no more time. Take the computer to the fortress shuttle bay. You can fly out in one of their ships. We'll rendezvous in Republic space. Now go! <sighs> Got your escape awfully close. Grand Moff Gilran destroyed the fortress just moments after you left. We suffered heavy losses at Tural 5. The Dantuin, the Sirocco. More starfighters than I care to count. But there's no time to mourn the dead. We must strike the Empire's prison before the enemy bolsters its defense. Down on Tural 5, your Jedi friend sent warnings. She didn't appear, but it was definitely her voice. Good. She's a powerful ally, and her counsel is useful. Always listen. 
My technicians have plugged the Gree computer into the Telos's hyperdrive. We're already calculating a safe route to Maelstrom Prison. When we arrive, I need my best people leading the raid. You're the Jedi prisoner's only hope of escaping alive. Do we have a plan to free the rest of the captives? We're not just leaving them there, are we? The facility was specifically built for the Jedi prisoner. The good news is, you should only have to break open one cell. This mission will cost more lives before it's done. But it's a necessary sacrifice. The Jedi prisoner can end this war. Save countless worlds. We'll be jumping to hyperspace soon. Head for the shuttle base. Be ready to launch on my signal. May the Force be with you. Persistence is impressive. Most of my foes have the decency to die quickly. Yes, I arrived before you. Bided my time in the nebula. Otek spread his forces too thin. It will cost him his life. And yours. Darth Malgus will be most pleased. You'll find Master Oteg and I can survive anything you dish out. Feeling invincible, are we? Good. Makes my victory even sweeter. Scurry about our prison. After I destroy your fleet, I'll find you. This is Okeg. We've sliced the enemy's comm frequency. Kilran's got us pinched between his fleet and the prison's autocannons. The Jedi prisoner must be freed, even if it means losing the fleet. As long as we're between you and Kilran, you're protected. If you stay here, you'll die. Fall back. Kilran can't stop this rescue. We'll make a tactical retreat, draw off enemy warships, divide their forces. I'll keep the comm channel open. Good luck. So much trouble from one Republic operative, it almost strains credulity. My lord, I promise to rid you of this nuisance. This embarrassing farce ends here. Securing the Emperor's prisoner is your only priority. Deal with this annoyance another time. There's no time like the present, my lord. I'll accomplish both objectives. No matter how good you think you are, it won't be enough. Jedi, always full of confidence. Until you burn a hole through them. The Empire salutes you, Grand Moff Kilran. I leave you to reclaim your honor. Glory to the Empire! What's happened? I can feel... No. No! What have you done? There's nothing to restrain him now. You were the one being restrained. My struggle held the Emperor in check. How did you find me? Your strength fails. You must be free, or all is lost. You should be one with the Force, finally at peace. No peace while you suffer. The Emperor drowns you in black waters. He wants me to be Darth Revan again, serve him as I did centuries ago. The Hollow Records say you brought the Republic to its knees as a Sith, and saved it as a Jedi. They also say you're dead. I am dead and reborn over and over, Jedi, Sith, many lifetimes. 
I led my allies to the galaxy's edge to destroy the Emperor. We didn't understand his true power. I lost everyone. Betrayed from within. The Emperor imprisoned me, kept me alive with Sith alchemy. Used me. One of your allies stabbed you in the back? I assume they paid for that. He still lives by the same dark force as I do, serving as the Emperor's executioner. His undying wrath. The Emperor used me as his link to the light side of the Force, the Jedi Order. Through me, he saw visions. But that same link also gave me influence. I convinced the Emperor peace was in his best interest. Tempered his hate. The peace is lost. The Emperor makes his final war. Stop him. Flee this place while you can. Use the enemy's vessels. Thank you, old friend. I will finish what we started. So many lost for my freedom. I met Master Oteg. He left to inform Republic High Command of the casualties. They're devastating. My only consolation is to see the Jedi still produce great warriors. Wish I'd had you on my side when I faced the Emperor. We'll get our chance at him someday. When we do, I won't let you down. Knowing you're the vanguard of our order gives me hope. My link to the Emperor is broken, but I learned a lot as his prisoner. Centuries of knowledge. I'll share everything with the Jedi Council. Then, I'll end this blasted war and the Sith Empire forever. If you need allies, you can always call on me. You gave me freedom. That's more than enough. There's one secret the Emperor never pried from me. A place called the Foundry. In the wrong hands, it can exterminate civilizations. In my hands, it will save the galaxy. You should return to the fight for as long as it lasts. Before I go, who was that woman who led us to you? She was a great Jedi. My most trusted ally. History remembers her as the Exile. To me, she was... more. Your shuttle to Python is fueled and ready, my friend. It's time. Goodbye. I won't forget what you did today. Neither will I. You not only saved him, but you helped spare the fleet additional losses. I was only doing what was right. Humility is good. In moderation. Sometimes you just have to accept you're a hero. Thanks to you, we've taken a great step toward final victory over the Empire. May the Force be with you. <laughs>